My name is Jens and I'm a pig farmer working in inland North Canterbury. I farm at Patoa together with my wife Anne and my business partner Steve and Josie and the four of us have worked together here for over 10 years. Well, Jens and I are always very passionate about wanting to run pigs outdoors. Uh, we always believe that uh, pigs would enjoy being outdoors and having the freedom to move around. For us, it was the only way that we would be happy farming. There are two parts to pig farming, pig breeding, and secondly, finishing progeny of the breeding herds to market. And we do both of these at Patoa. About a week to two weeks before farrowing, the sows are moved to a paddock that has eight farrowing huts. One feature of these farrowing huts is the ramp and roller in the entrance. After the sow is given birth, we put them on and the sow has the ability to go in and out of the hut whenever she wishes, but it keeps the piglets confined to the hut for the first seven to 10 days. Later on, the piglets are free to roam outside. At that stage, the sows have got access to ad lib feed and they're able to have food whenever they want. Yet when the piglets leave the sow, they go into our stage one finishing pens and it's a similar sort of environment to the farrowing hut in that there's straw bedding. The stage one pen consists of a hut, a feed station and an outside yard and this gives the pigs options. They can be inside if the weather is bad but they also have the option of being outside if they wish. In the stage two pen, there is a large number of pigs, about 500 in a group, again on straw bedding. And one of the features is that new straw is added on a daily basis. And we have a, a specialized machine that helps us do that. Pigs love living in straw. It keeps them warm and it uh, absorbs all the effluent. And it's just a, a pleasant medium for them to live on. Our pigs are on ad lib water and feed, so they get all the feed and water that they want. As a result of that, they grow to their potential. The growth rates we are achieving are quite fast, and that is better because the meat quality of younger animals is better than older animals. At Patoa, we have over 40 workers, and they are passionate about doing a good job with the pigs they're caring for. I love working with the pigs, the, the, every animal is individual. I love to see them in their natural environment where they can, in the heat of the day, lie around in the mud and in the cool of winter, they're all curled up in two foot of straw. We treat them well, they treat us well.